Hello and welcome to Sea Turtle Tales, an update on the Sea Turtle Rehabilitation Program at the Two Oceans Aquarium. In this the first episode, we will be telling you a little bit more about how we rehabilitate sea turtles, why we do it and how you can help us. Let's start off by saying that we do not rehabilitate terrapins like these or land tortoises like this little guy. But we do rehabilitate a number of sea turtles, just like Otto. Around April each year, a number of hatchling loggerhead turtles, weighing as little as 35 grams, wash up on Cape Town and Western Cape beaches. Concerned members of the public bring them to the aquarium for rehabilitation. Once they have been rehabilitated, they are flown to a shark seawolf in Durban, where they are then released. But these are not the only sea turtles that are being stranded on our beaches. We've also rehabilitated and currently are rehabilitating sea turtles that weigh anything between 1 and 80 kilograms. Sea turtles are normally found in waters considerably warmer than those of the Cape Town coasts. So when we find turtles on Cape Town beaches, it means that they are probably suffering from dehydration and hypothermia and might also be suffering from infection and other injuries and they are normally covered in all sorts of growths. Each sea turtle that is brought to the aquarium is assessed and an appropriate course of rehabilitation and treatment is decided on. Sea turtles have lungs just like you and I and they need to lift their heads above the water surface to be able to breathe. Sometimes they're just too weak to do this so we make them special neoprene jackets to help them. Once the turtles have been rehabilitated, they are taken to the appropriate areas and released. Why do we rehabilitate sea turtles? Well, sea turtle numbers are rapidly declining. There are seven sea turtle species in the world. Of these, two species have been classified as endangered, two as vulnerable, Two is critically endangered and one is data deficient. Only two of these species nest on the KwaZulu Natal coast. Before we can start the rehabilitation process, we need to get the turtle. So, what should you do if you find a sea turtle on Cape Town Beach? Please do not put the turtle back into the water. It probably needs to be seen by a vet. Contact the aquarium on 021 418 3823. Keep the turtle dry and at room temperature. If you place the turtle in a container, ensure that that container has enough air holes for the turtle to breathe freely. Get the turtle to the aquarium as soon as possible. Each sea turtle that we receive for rehabilitation is unique. Join me next time as I introduce you to some of these amazing animals. In the meantime, please visit our website to read more about the rehabilitation program and to donate to this course.